Have you ever been frustrated by the inability of the vending machines on campus to process $5 bills? Maybe you're just looking for a snack, or maybe you miss lunch and you need some energy to stay awake through your three-hour lap. Even if you have your wallet, you are still in danger of walking away hungry. Unless you have $1 bills or pocket change, you might be out of luck. This is exactly why the vending machines on campus need to have the ability to process $5 bills. The lack of this ability actively discourages the sale of contents of these machines lowering their value and efficiency. Students and faculty alike will pass up on a soda or snack because they simply don't have the time to search for someone who can break their fives, tens, or twenties in the time between classes and appointments. Hunger or thirst that could be prevented by this simple fix is a large distraction in an educational institution setting such as Dort College. Instead of taking thorough notes, students daydream about their next meal. Rather than delivering a well put together lecture, professors constantly lose their train of thought as their empty stomach cries out in pain. There is no downside to this easy fix. The machine sponsors win with increased sales of vending machine commodities. Consumers win with the ability to buy what they want when they want it. And vendors win when they profit off of the increase in need to stock these machines. In conclusion, Vending machines should be able to process $5 bills. The lack of this ability discourages the sales and services, serves to facilitate the distraction of hunger in the classroom. Everyone wins with increased options, sales, and stocking of vending machines.